It's about love. <laughs> it's about avoidance. It's about tradition. It's about quiet. It's about sex. It's about selling. Family. Uh, hi, I'm Mark Delaventura. Uh, I'm an actor, writer, director, and uh, acting coach. Uh, we have our first rehearsal for The Last Schwartz with Parade Productions. I play Simon Schwartz, who's the middle brother, and uh, he's an astronomer, he's obsessed with science, and uh, he's in his own little world for, for, for most of the show. Space? I think if you have a family, you'll, you'll definitely have a good time watching this one tear each other apart. Candace Kaplan. I play Norma. I'm the oldest sibling. Well, it, it well, the last short, so it does, of course, touch on um, tradition and, and, you know, and, and that long, you know, Jews have always had this, will we last, you know? So it's kind of also a play on it. It's like, will this family last? Or will this family have a successor? Will this family go on? And then, it does say about the family of the Schwartzes and the family of, of, of Judaism and the Jewish family overall, but it's not about Judaism. It's about each crazy family and, and where you find the craziness in each family. I like to say that these characters are at their best worst when we see them. History. I'm Candace Kaplan. Come see the Schwartz family and the last Schwartz. I'm Kim Ostranko. Well, her name is Bonnie, and she has married into this very unusual family. She converted to Judaism uh, to be married into a family to her. And uh, it's been a roller coaster ride for her, in a sense. <laughs> it's a lot of fun. I love this play because it's, it's not just a comedy, and it's not just a drama. It's truly both, sometimes at the same time. And it bounces back and forth really easily between the two. And I think it's very well written and has uh, very real characters, but they're all very distinctly drawn. And uh, there's definitely going to be a lot for people to relate to, whether or not the whole Jewish thing doesn't really matter if you're from a family. <laughs> you know, just, but, but dysfunction is what makes people interesting. You know, who wants to be the Brady Bunch? Well, I won't. Yeah, there, there are some key revelations. One of them that was mentioned before about Kia, and then my character has a rather uh, emotional and very dramatic revelation towards the end that I won't say. But she describes a very traumatic event that happened to her that was the turning point in her life. Family. I am Kim Ostranko. Come see the Laugh Schwartz at the Meisner Park Studio Theater. It is not the ring Bunch. My name is Betsy Graver. We are at Meisner Park in Boca Raton, Florida. I play Kia who is coming to meet the family for the first time. She's a girlfriend of one of the characters, and she's very different from everyone else. And it's very apparent just how different. Fame. She's, without giving anything away, she's had a very different upbringing than the Schwartz have had. And, um, different beliefs, a different way of living, a different lifestyle. And so that kind of all clashes in a really funny and fun way. Well, she's got some really great lines that come out of nowhere, and that's going to be a lot of fun for me to do, and I, hopefully for people to watch. Um, she's a very strong life force. It's a fun character. Everybody's a really fun character, and I think something really fun to watch for everybody is, and I know a lot of people have already said this, is how they all interact because everybody is their own individual person. Hi, my name is Betsy Graver, and come see us in The Last Shorts, January 31st at Meisner Park. No, I, everything about my family is perfect. <laughs> uh, Gene is the youngest brother. He's kind of the golden boy of the family. Uh, he directs commercials, uh, and uh, I think of him as like a holiday family member, meaning he prefers to see his family on holidays, and that's probably enough family. I, I think maybe Gene doesn't really think he belongs in that family as much as, um, you know, but then I think probably most of them feel that way. I think of the whole play in itself, it, it's a really wonderful script, it's a really, you know, like everybody's talked about, it's funny, it's touching, you know, it's about family, you know, family scars you, but family heals you, and I think that it's, it's a really beautiful uh, demonstration of that.
I'm Matt Stabile. I hope you'll come check out the finest that South Florida has to offer in the last Schwartz. Yeah, hi, I'm Ken Clement. I love working with Kim because she comes in and she's got a very specific vision in her head and she is also at the same time somehow open-minded. And so it's always just having a fun time at rehearsal. And oh boy. Family. Why? I've never met a functional family. I, I, I really haven't, you know, I, I, I was, it's gonna happen. I mean, there's parts of this play that really make me laugh just reading the script, the whole. The, the coffee table, my coffee table is a kind of funny scene. And it just it, it, it goes places you don't expect and it's fun and everybody in everybody every character in the show has a moment to take the stage and own the show. It's really fun that way. Hi, I'm Ken Clement. Come see the Lash Warts or you're dead to me.